Why, well, hello there, stranger. What brings you to this party? Everyone's gone. It's about time you got here. Better late than never, I suppose. She's here, just as I knew she'd be. She always has to come to one of my parties. I can't wait for her to be dead. The target's name is Primrose. She's wearing a mask in the shape of a rose. She's not the most creative person. Currently, she's in the ballroom, trying to find someone to dance with her, I suppose. If anyone wants to dance with someone with two left feet. I've been thinking of some ways to end her life. Now, you do look incredibly strong. You have beautiful hands. However, I think we need to make her death look a little less violent, possibly more accidental. She and I are rivals, and I don't want anyone suspecting that I had anything to do with her death. But I can't wait for her to be gone. I wouldn't have to listen to her constantly blather on about, isn't it funny how the two winemakers of the country are both named after flowers? No, it isn't that unusual. Half the people in this city are named after some kind of plant. My name is Primrose, and your name is Iris. Isn't that fun? Wretched creature. Ugh. Her death will be a blessing to us all. Now, well, I've heard stories about your work, and I'm quite impressed. I'm looking forward to seeing you work. But again, I've thought of a few ideas of how to take her out. And you are the expert, so I will let you decide in the end. However, I, I'm just so excited. I just want to be a part of this process. Uh, let's see. And, oh, did anyone see you enter the building? Okay. And by the way, I love your mask. Very appropriate. First thing, I was thinking about strangulation. Red is Primrose's favorite color. Red wine is her favorite beverage. She'll probably drink enough to get drunk. That's when you can strike. Perhaps you can offer to take her outside for some fresh air. I'm sure she's going to vomit at some point, and I don't want her to do it on the floor. I mean, I don't have to clean it up myself. I have people for that, but I'd rather not have them bother with that either. You can take her outside. When she's not looking, you can wrap this around her neck and pull and pull. There's a pond on my property. If you wish, you can put her body there. Perhaps you could hide her body in the woods nearby. Actually, maybe the woods would be nice. Maybe some coyotes will eat through her flesh. I suppose her body doesn't need to be found. It can just... She can just disappear forever. I'd be the only one who'd know what actually happened to her. That's exciting too. Again, you are the professional. I'll let you decide the details. Let me think of the ribbon idea. You could even wear this. She would even know. I think it would look good with your outfit.
Have you ever killed a noble before? Oh, I probably shouldn't ask such details. I like to keep your work secretive, I'm sure. Primrose, again, is wearing a mask like a rose. She has red hair. It's dyed. She's not a natural redhead. She's wearing red lipstick. Her nails are painted red. Her dress is also red. She's really going all in on the rose theme. I'm not sure if I should bring roses to her funeral or irises. My luck. We've met. I thought it'd be a lot harder to find someone who does your type of work so quickly. I truly appreciate you fitting me into your busy, busy schedule. I mean, I'm sure it's busy. I mean, people are dropping like flies around here. I'm sure you have something to do with that. If you do well tonight, I may have more uses for you. So, let's look at the next option. As I mentioned, Primrose greatly likes to drink wine. I have some poison. This poison it's completely colorless, and it's completely odorless. You can slip it into her drink at some point. Another fun thing about this particular poison is it doesn't act right away. So she can spend the rest of her night partying, eating my food, drinking my wine, and then die later in the day. Mm -hmm. I wonder how, actually, I wonder how much. I forgot to ask that particular question. If you use the whole bottle, will she die instantly? Or will it be more painful? Again, I'll let you decide. If you do kill her quickly, please try to do it away from the crowd. As much fun as I would like to tell people that Primrose died on my estate. I don't want it happening directly in front of everyone because they might suspect something. Perhaps you could tell Primrose that you find her beautiful and wish to give her a drink. Maybe take her to a different part of the house. I have an art room. Yes, I have an art room. You can try taking her there. I've asked my servants to keep people out, but I can make a special exception for you. It should be fairly quiet and private in there. You can just get her to drink. And she'll be dead at some point. If she dies instantly, you'll be able to move her body. Poison cost a lot of money. I'm looking forward to it being used. Do you have experiences with poison? I've been working on my eulogy. I'm sure I'll be asked to give some type of speech at her wedding. Funeral, I mean, I had to do it at her wedding too. I don't know why she invited me 
do her wedding online. It was awful. She asked me to give a speech. I was not prepared. I think she did it just to embarrass me. The marriage didn't last long, by the way. Which I'm grateful for, since if she does die mysteriously, it's usually the spouse that people look for. Actually, it was the second worst day of my life. The first worst day was the day I met Primrose. But the best day is going to be when she dies, which is going to be very, very soon. It's all thanks to you. Thank you. Truly thank you. Do you like the poison idea? Slip it into her drink. And do the work for you. <laughs> I have another plan if you don't like either of those two. perfume bottle. But if you like this idea, I can place a very special perfume in here. Primrose is terribly allergic to lilac. Ironic, we're all named after flowers and she's allergic to one. You can have her have a severe allergic reaction. She'll never know what hit her. And you can draw her away to a semi private area. Offer to give her a little spritz of perfume. Just claim that it smells like rose, and I'm sure she'll agree to it. Just a little. <laughs> Make sure to get it right in her face. Sure, should be dead within a few minutes. Part of the reason I want you to, if you choose to do this plan, you to do it, since you can always claim that you just didn't know she was allergic to lilac. It could be an accident. If no one hears you claim that it was made out of roses, then you can just claim ignorance. There's a garden near the back of the estate. You could take her out there, claim that there's some beautiful roses. I'm sure she'll run out there all on her own. And when you get her alone, you can mention that that I make perfumes and that you maybe have a new one for her to try. Scented like roses. She'll probably say, oh yeah, spray that on me, right, in the, right all over my body. That's probably what she'll say. That's when you can get her right in the eyes. Maybe get her to open her mouth and spray it right in her throat. I'm a little bit sad. Not that she's going to be dead soon. That I won't be able to see it. So, perhaps you could write down what happened, or 
if you have a really good memory, just remember every detail and share it with me later. I'll pay you extra if you do. soon. They're going to be suspicious if I'm gone too long. I am the host after all. So let's go over our plan again. We have strangulation possibly. The most violent way to go. It takes quite a bit of time to strangle someone. Not the fastest way. Possibility, if that's what you desire. And we have poison. Might be a bit harder to do this one since you have to find a way to put this in her drink without her or anyone else noticing. And depending on how much poison you use will determine on how fast she dies, so it could be instant or could be several hours from now. But if she does die instantly, you'll have to take care of the body. I can't have it inside the house. you do this, you can always claim ignorance, but you may be questioned, and you may not want to be questioned. You don't want to be recognized by an official. I certainly don't want you recognized. If you are caught, we never met, but I will try to help you in any way I can. You are doing me a great favor after all. Unless you have another idea. Those are the ones that I have prepared. How would you like to kill Primrose? Oh, excellent. You truly are a master of your craft. artist. I couldn't have asked for better. She's still in the ballroom. You can gather your supplies and take her out when you're ready. I'll be mingling, trying to look like I'm enjoying myself. But to let you know, I, I truly appreciate what you're doing. And you will be paid. I promise, doubled, if you can hide the body. I'd love to have my coyotes either. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just, I'm just so excited. Very soon Primrose will be gone. And it'll just be me. Gather your things. And do 